Hello and welcome to the Red Men TV. I'm Chris Page and I'm stood outside Jacob's Cracker Factory in Liverpool, um, where there's some good stuff going on today. You know, we're, we're meeting Jamie Carrier again. He's down here. His 23 Foundation are donating a framed sign shirt to the factory uh, because the factory have very kindly donated a lot of food to the food banks up here in Liverpool. So we're going to go in and see just what is going to happen today. How important is this that you're able to to be a part of this? No, it's brilliant. I mean, the two lads involved, Everton and, and Liverpool, I think it was brilliant yesterday. Obviously, besides the game, what happened before the game, both sets of supporters getting uh, involved, and you know, with our link, maybe our profile, if you like, with our charity, uh, we can get Jacobs involved, and I think they're going to make a big difference to, uh, as we know, you know, the fan support and food banks. What was the actual donation amount? How many packets of, of biscuits did you did you give? Yeah, well, the, the donation is ongoing. So we, we've been talking with the guys today about setting up a weekly a weekly drop off. Uh, but so far, uh, since we, we we sort of pulled together the partnerships, around about twelve thousand packets. Wow. I think this epitomises who and what we hoped for three years ago when we first started fan supporting food banks. It was about reds and blues working together. We've spent the last fourteen hours since the match attempting to order all the food that we collected yesterday and uh, we probably collected over two tonne of food at the match yesterday. Wow. That's not down to us and we've always believed that mm -hmm. food poverty, not just in Merseyside but in every major town and city across the country, won't be uh, resolved uh, by people like me and them standing outside stadiums, it'll be resolved by companies and organisations like yours doing what you just doing. Just thanks very much for what you're doing, because as Dave said, what you give us, it takes us months and months and months to uh, to collect in the cold uh, winter outside the football stadium. So more companies, we think, like yourself, uh, and, and actually do something instead of talking about it. Uh, we've completely received them companies, and with Les and Jamie's help, they've been fantastic in setting this up because we wouldn't have the facility to do that. So, thanks very much for the audience have done. I think it's just a fantastic way to support the local community. I think, uh, particularly this time of year, uh, the community really needs to come together and, and really work together in, in tackling uh, food poverty. And, and, and we're just in a position to be able to support and I think it's you know it, it's the role of businesses like ours to, to be able to do that so it's fantastic uh, fantastic charity and we're just more than happy to, to be involved 